and he's doing his thing right now. Threw for 10 plus touchdowns. So this is going to be a hot game right now. And what I don't really understand is how the Texas is the underdog. That's what I don't understand. But if you ask me, I'm putting my money on Texas. This is going to be a great game, though. They had every piece. The main thing was when Watson, they see Watson wasn't healthy enough. They just had to, you know, put in the right quarterback that can run the system. Joe Flacco have had a, a, a ridiculous, a, a ridiculous playoff performance before. He done won a Super Bowl. He is a former Super Bowl champion in MVP. Let's not forget that. But he will give you the ball. He throw a lot of interceptions. That's a good chance. Because that defense is phenomenal. Being led by my favorite defense, defense and defensive player probably is Miles Garrett. Got 14 sacks this season. Going crazy. You know, y'all, you know, they got him here, they got him there, they got him at nose guard. You remember he was doing, he was walking up doing this, like he was on the basketball court and went this way and went that way. He, the dude's a dog. They number one in three categories. As far as on their defense, they they the number one team defensive team on third. They the number one team in, in, in um, passing yards allowed, and in total yards. If the passers get going for the Browns and they go up, it could be a problem. But this Texas team is dangerous. Um, the Browns has been playing great, but I got the Texas winning at home. That's just me.